come and catch the vibe. Welcome to Easy Weekend. It's Easy Weekend. Cats can't see me. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I am married. So let's, let's get this out the way before my wife gets angry. Because any pretty girl sits next to me, it's a problem. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that, right? I love you. I love you. All right, it's the sit down. Red Bull Noe is in the building. How are you doing this afternoon, miss? Yes, I'm good. How are you? I can't complain. Uh, what brings you to the sit down this afternoon? I'm here to discuss my new single, Running Back. Okay, yes. H- how? <laughs> I, I, when I met you, you weren't an artist. When, when, did, you, when did the transition <clears throat> beca- begin? Um, I had a traumatic situation, right? No, it was, it was a traumatic <laughs> situation, right? Let me just go to that one. Um, it just... You know, I could have I could have died, so it just opened up my eyes. Like, um, let me do everything that I always wanted to do: mm. music, acting. You know, my clothing line, drip. I know. Mm-hmm. Um, just everything. I just... Um, what <clears throat> what traumatic experience happened to you? Because I've um, seen it, I, I wouldn't understand. Would you like to speak about it again? Yeah, it's a touchy situation, but yeah, someone came into my house with a gun. Um, the aftermath was a broken finger. Um, my lip was split. They had to stitch it up. Um, they had to stitch, um, above my eye. I had a broken nose, my teeth. I had to redo my teeth because it was broke. Do you know why the person, they tried to rob you? Was it like... No, I I wasn't robbed. (laughs) I had my watch on, my... My jewelry on, everything still was on. No, they didn't take anything. So they just beat you up. Yes, with the gun, and or, you know the the clip dropped out the gun. Oh. And my grandma ran downstairs. Oh, your grandma's in the house. She too. was upstairs in the bathroom. I, oh, I came wow. home to take her to a cancer appointment. She had a, you know, she had cancer. She had an appointment, a doctor's appointment. So, I wasn't, I wasn't at home. I worked the night before, right? I didn't go home. I went to. My boo's house. I was talking to a guy. I went to his house in Long Island. So um, my grandma said, oh, I'm at the house. You have a, you know, you got to take me to my doctor's appointment. I said, okay. I pulled up. That was the next day. Mm-hmm. Um, she said, oh, let me in the house. I got to pee. So I let her in the house. I was feeding the dog while I was there, too. Next thing you know, because we was in and out. We didn't lock the doors. We This was broad day. Like, this was like one or 12 in the afternoon, something like that. Damn. Um, maybe two, because, yeah, when the um, cops came, the police, ambulance came, the kids was out of school, yeah, so it's probably like 2 o'clock. Mm. But, yeah, um, he ran out when she came downstairs hollering. He, he ran out, yeah. Did you see the person? Was he masked? Was yes, he had, a, he had a mask on, but I know who he is. Yeah, I know who he is. He had a mask on. I know his head. I know his eyes. I know who he is. And he said something to me. That's got to be the most scariest thing to ever <clears throat> have to happen to you. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. So so this sparked you to to become a clothing designer and a, and a rapper now? Rapper, um, this music, just acting, just do everything I always wanted to do because I could have lost my life. And it's just like, I'm like, let me do everything I want to do. Okay. So now talk to me about music. How, how's that been going for you? Are you enjoying the music life? Are you a studio l- a rat? Like, what, what, what? How would you describe your your uh, rapper career so far? I'm just getting started, so I'm just going in the studio, laying down as much songs as I can because, you know, I have a label that's interested in me. They said they want to see a bigger catalog, so mm-hmm. I need to go in and do as much as I can. Mm-hmm. So, who, who who are some of the rappers that you looked up to? Or, or that you're kind of uh, pacing yourself to be around. What you mean, like to do music with me? No, who who are the who are the, some of the rappers that inspired you to be the rapper you are today? Like who whose bars um, do, do you feel the most? I love Cardi B, um, Little Kim, um, Foxy, Trina. Nah, yeah, that's about it. See, this is where I'm supposed to be messing. Go ahead, be messy. This, this Go ahead. Be messy, son. <laughs> There's somebody off that list. Is there a reason why you left <laughs> said woman off le- said list? Who are you talking about? 
Okay. <laughs> this, is, this is how we gonna go. This is how we gonna go. I don't know what you're talking so, about. A long time ago, a long, mm-hmm. long time ago. Yeah. Um, I used to host at strip clubs and stuff. So this is where I know Miss Snowy, right? Yeah. I got a DM one day and she said, "Tell woman who won't really be really named to stop stealing men." I said, <laughs> "Excuse me, what do you mean?" So she was like, "You really want to finish the story?" Um, I forgot what I did. <laughs> <laughs> but so apparently, yeah. So go ahead. So you and her. I was sh- upset, you know. Somebody is still my man, you know. How is it? But stole? right now, right now, I'm just it's it's I'm happy. Everything, life has been much better since she stole the man, you know. So uh, how did uh, stole is such a strong word though. Yeah. So he was. Well, he he's was mine. Yours. He's mine. I don't want my name's out. But yeah, he was mine. And just one day, gone. Gone. I DM'd her. She read it. She seen it. She didn't say nothing back. I left a comment on her page. Like, oh, this is why you're not answering the phone? Oh, shit. And nothing. Nothing. She didn't say nothing. Yeah, I heard from him. And what he said? Um, cause he thought I was talking to his friend. That's you know he was very upset. He called me, threatened me. So you're good though. I'm good. I'm good. Okay, Everything's so good. musically, what are we what are we looking like? Well, is there an <clears throat> album coming out? Is it an EP or is it just singles right now? What are we What are we working um, on? Um, I'm just dropping, just dropping songs, and I want to put like a vision with every song. Like every song I want to drop, I want a video. Mm-hmm. And that's it. Are they playing your music in these clubs that you be at? Yeah. Better shit. Mm-hmm. The clothing line. How's that been going? I know. I see. I see a lot of people are are, are tagging you with their with their stuff. Yeah, you know the ladies. I need something for the men the next. I need I like mean, if you need a model. I got you. Got you. Got you. Dad bods are in style. Stop it. I see y'all laughing. <laughs> Dad bods. I see y'all laughing. Nah, you know every shape is it's nothing wrong with that. Yo, don't do that. Don't do that. You see, yo, yo, you know what? No, yo, Tani. Listen, what's the name of the single? <laughs> Run it back. Run it back. Why Run did you back. pick that? Why did I pick that? Um, Because the song is called Run It Back. I'm going to keep saying and run it back. I want the DJs to hear my song and run it back. Mm-hmm. Hit us in my song, run it back. Mm-hmm. The ladies in my song, run it back. When you hear my song, run it back. Uh, what do the streamers numbers look like? They good? Um, I don't even know, honestly. Oh, I don't. I haven't checked. <laughs> um. So what else should we know about Noe? Um, this you're gonna see me on TV soon. So just look out. I want y'all There's to look out. There's a lot of channels on TV, no, my guy. You know, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see you on TV soon. Hey, wait, wait, give me a channel. We got a we got the Netflix, right? Okay, we're doing and what? And then we got the VH1. So you're gonna be seeing me on those. Okay, things. okay, okay. See, don't be vague with me, son. Don't be. Vague. I can't tell so, okay, everything I, you yet. Gotta tell me it's the a name surprise. Of is it is it a a reality show? Is one it a, one of them is a reality show. Yeah. VH1. Mm-hmm. Oh gosh, yeah. We'll figure it out. Listen, I'm not. We're not dumb. They're not dumb. So Netflix. And a VH1, okay. Mm-hmm. Are you mm-hmm. happy with how you're being portrayed in both shows? Yeah. Have you seen the, the, the finished product yet? The Netflix is finished. I'm cool. So you saw what that looked like already? Mm-hmm. Okay. So when I turn this camera off, I want to know exactly what this VH1 <laughs> situation looks like. Um, because I don't know. What, we'll talk about it. Anyways, um, the clothing, doing well. Doing well, On TV, I'm happy. TV, mm-hmm. doing well, apparently. Mm-hmm. The music is, is getting going. Getting going, yeah. What else? Are you single? What what can the guys look for? Because they're in the DMs. They all in the DMs. Noel yeah. Chipo. There you go. That's the next. Um, I'm gonna have clothes saying no El Chipos, and I want all the fellas and all the ladies to wear that no El Chipos. Why? Because we don't want no cheap no El Chipos. What's wrong with being cheap? See? No, we can't do that. Can't being not... frugal is very amazing to me. No, 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 no. Why? No. Why would you want to be a El Chipo? If, listen, but it, the reason daddy, I, yeah, why would you want to be an old cheaper trying to talk to me? Right, listen, I'm married. I'm not trying to talk to no, you. No, no, not you. I'm, I'm, talking I'm, about, I'm talking about for the fellas yeah, out but there. I, I'm going to tell you from a man's perspective. Go ahead. If you can be frugal with my money, I might love you a little differently. Because if you're if you if you take in mind that damn I don't want to spend all this niggas bread, maybe I might, you know what I'm saying, look at you differently. Another girl that I'm like, she's just gonna spend me dry, like, uh, 
I'm cool on you. No, uh, no, 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 no. See, I, 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 I be on a budget. You see me when I was in the club. I wasn't. We wasn't with bricks. You, was, like, you was on a budget. That was like, <laughs> with you, my people. So, so <laughs> I appreciate all the love when I'm at the bar. I appreciate all the love, but you know, but when my peoples come that want to spend. You Three thousand, five thousand, ten thousand. I know what time it was. Move over a little bit, you know, with the drink in your hookah. They want to buy bottles. They want to cash out. Listen, I would go. No there. El Cheapo. I, I wouldn't spend more than five hundred. <laughs> Why would I do that? <laughs> How many did I have a good time? All then? of that is. I'm not unappreciative. Cool. I appreciate I have everything. Bottle, my little hookah, spent my little five, and I was out the way. I know when the, when them niggas came in, what they look like. All right, listen. No way. I see you next week. I get out the way. And it's another guy that's the El Cheaper right now trying to talk to me, right? He's a millionaire, right? He said, okay, I have a gift. I want to get you a gift. What size you wear? What size shoe you wear? So I said, 40. He going to text me back and say, um, I mean, like, you know, U.S. size is like, you know, Dunks, Jordans. <laughs> I'm like, oh, no. He was like, no European sizes. I'm like, is he serious? I didn't even... Um, like respond back, and he put the he put the question mark the other day. You could tell I don't know nothing about nothing because when she said forty, I was like, <laughs> huh? But what? like, why would you even? Isn't that crazy? You want to holler at me? You want to ask me? Do I want Jordans or Dunks? I mean, okay. See, and there's another thing. I gotta start off slow, right? No, I can't start no. off with the Chanel and the Gucci right Yes. Off How? Yes. Bro, okay. See, yes. listen. I'm sweating just thinking about this. This is just getting me annoyed. No. Like, how am I supposed to spend all this money on you and we just talking? You want to get my attention. You want me to like, you know, we cool or whatever. How about but you wanna discussion? Like, how about how about conversing? You know, all of that. But I need not no Jordans, not no <laughs> not no dogs. You, would, I would have been happy with flowers. You know, nice big, a hundred roses, flowers, flowers. a hundred yeah, roses. Yeah. So so okay, damn. The so like, ducks. So so like, all right, ready? All right, damn. I'm this is just a scenario, babe. Just a scenario. <clears throat> We're talking. It's Christmas time. We're just talking. We haven't even had sex yet. What I'm supposed to buy you? Am I supposed to get you a gift? Hell yeah. What I'm supposed to get you? A Chanel bag. What? Yes. I haven't even dipped in the vagina yet, and I'm supposed to come out that much bread. I get gifts on the regular, and they have not touched me. Uh, I mean, I'm no not, dates, I, I, no nothing. I, I'm not. I'm not disputing that. I'm just saying, what is the cap of the bread? Like, I'm supposed to come out ten racks on a Christmas gift for somebody I haven't, I haven't even tried yet. Yes, that's the one right there. That's the one. Ten racks on a gift, Christmas. Thank you. Thank God I'm married. Anyway, <laughs> that's the best. What? So how much are you spending? On what? <laughs> <laughs> on what? <laughs> I'm also spending on what? On a gift. What do you get him for Christmas? With the guy? Yes. 10K. That want to talk to me? Yes. For Christmas. He want to capture my attention. He want to... So he shouldn't expect a gift? Yeah, I'm going to get him a gift. What are you going to get him? Um... Does that determine... Does your gift determine what he got you? Yes. So how do you... So you're not going to get a gift until he buys you a gift? I need... To, like, most of the time they come and show love at my bar. You know, I'm going to get them a gift. Um... I'll probably get something like a nice pair of sneakers, thousand dollars, twelve hundred sneakers. There's nothing wrong with that. Pair of jeans. I'm not an El Cheapo. But I gotta drop ten racks though. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that shit is crazy. Yes. That shit is crazy. I guess listen, I guess I'm El Cheapo. Fuck it. Uh, I'm yeah. just trying not to stop the fact that I guess <laughs> But you can still can you still promote my shirt like the one that say no El Cheapo? Even you. though you're El Cheapo? You can on, still on the back, on the back it'll say <laughs> I am LG. Okay. <laughs> I got to get a custom one gotcha. for you. Got gotcha. you. All right. So where, where can they get the clothes? Dripbyno.com. Mm -hmm. How can they stream the music? Um, Red Bone No. Okay. Just look me up and you're going to see everything. It's on all platforms. Gotcha. Anything else before we go? Um, I don't think so. Okay. So make sure you follow my, my, my friend Red Bone No. Yes. Um... No El Cheapo. No El Cheapos, please, please, um, we'll please. We'll be watching out for the VH1 and the Netflix stuff. Yep. And the music going to be dropping with the visuals. Y'all just stay tuned. How soon is the next one? <sighs> like next two weeks. Ooh. Okay, so we Yeah, I'm trying to get 
get things rolling. Just want to be consistent as much as I can. As you should. That yep. is the best way. Because, you know, I have a lot of connections. Too. They just want to see me work. They don't want to, you know, sometimes people just be a one-hit one. I don't want to be that. I just want to work, work, work. Let them look at me and, you know. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> this was the sit down. Thank you for coming. All right. Thanks, you. Come and catch the vibe. Welcome to Easy Weekend. It's Easy Weekends. Cats can't see me.